Deer Hunter 2 is the game. It's gonna be an atmospheric game. It's a small indie game made by the Sock Pop Collective, which are, I think, Dutch. Uh, a bunch of people making games. One every two weeks or so? They are Patreon-based. They make a bit of money there. And they make a lot of very, very, very stylish games. I played at least once so far. I mean, I made at least one video of that. I just got a water bottle. This is gonna be a very atmospheric game. Uh, not a lot of action, no horror except... Spoiler alert to one skeleton, but you read that in the thumbnail. There's a deer. The game is about hunting deer. There's an arrow. I'm gonna use that arrow to hunt that deer later. Or another deer. There's another deer over there. Uh, in, in the in the distance. There's a lot of stuff on the floor. Some of it I can pick up, like the stick. I can press escape to see my inventory. I got one stick. Or... One sticks? I don't know. Let's get that uh, rock over here and pick up some more arrows. Here we go. We can throw rocks. Oops. We can drop stuff, but we can also throw. Um, I threw it on the ground. I threw it on the ground! Um, so I could pick it up again. Do you see these green lines? Oh, oh I got it. I got it. Oh, I think I'm gonna... Oh no, I'm gonna die. I should not have been telling you all this stuff. My first priority would have been to get water, because I woke up in the desert dry as a rock. Are rocks dry? And now I'm gonna gonna go back to sleep forever. At least I got four arrows. <sighs> Alright. Whoops. I didn't want to press the options. Okay, we're another guy. And uh, maybe we will find the corpse of the previous guy somewhere. But now let's just get that water, drink a little and run to that wa uh, oasis over there. Because everything else is a bit stupid. Okay, I think that's snake leather. Check it out, snake leather lying, lying around. I kind of want to get that stick there, but I am really low on water. So let's just run, run, run. And refill that water. Which, uh, totally not what Wild West movies teach you. You should not be drinking unfiltered water. Anyways, refill. Dirty water better than no water. Okay, let's drink. Also, we're standing in the shadow, so we're totally safe here. So, Deer Hunter is the name of the game, so we're gonna hunt some deer. We're gonna work towards hunting some deer. I picked up some of this stuff. Oh, look at that. There's a hat in the water. That's very good. It's uh, gonna help us with the heat. Hey, okay, I already did refill. Okay, now I can take, take, take. Uh, so I have a hat. No, I'm not gonna get that uh, dehydrated anymore. Still still gonna get dehydrated, but less, less so, less fast. So we have some uh, grass, maybe? Sticks? These are, um, well, feathers. We got a rope. Uh, snake skin. This is, I'm not sure, maybe some poison gland or something. Big stick and leather. And we can build a rope, uh, which is this, which we would need to make a bow. But also, uh, so far I have never had to make a bow when I played this game so far. Oh, there's a bird. I could always find one somewhere. I'm sneaking around so the bird doesn't run away. But I don't have anything to throw at the bird or shoot at the bird, so I'm not going to be able to... Yeah, there it, there it goes, running away. I got the stick now. I could try to throw the stick. Yeah! Alright, that bird dropped a, dropped a feather. I, oh no. Okay, can we make maybe make... Okay, let's drop that, take that, and now crafting. Arrow. Ta-da! Hmm. Also, we already have a quiver for the arrow. We didn't have to get one. Um, right, so there's a snake. Let's see if we can get it uh, with the rock. Oh, shoot! Oh, no! Oh, freaking heck, no! It bit me! Oh, no, I'm poisoned! Oh, no, I'm gonna die! What the heck? What was I thinking? What am I gonna do now? Uh, I'm gonna die, aren't I? Okay, I will have to try to fight this freaking 
snake for my freaking life. Come here, you piece of snake. Ah, darn it. Ah, freaking heck, aiming with a freaking stone is freaking impossible. At least the snake is not that interested. Ah, god. Ah, ah. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, come on. There we freaking go. Okay, and we are full. And it didn't drop, didn't drop a freaking poison thing. <sighs> I don't know what we're gonna do. I guess we're gonna just freaking die. Darn it. Oh, look at that. It's night time. And we're gonna die. Hey, hey, wait a second. I see some... Uh, let's see. Uh, okay, whatever. Let's just walk. But no, no, the poison go is gonna get me. I can see the health freaking heck. There was some poison berries or whatever they are over there. I could have... There are four. I see four in the distance. Four of these purple berries or whatever they are. Man, this death was so unnecessary. I... Uh, <laughs> for this let's play, I am performing as bad as I have never performed in this game before. Never. But now I see a lot of stuff in the distance. A lot of stuff. So this is gonna be nice. However, we're gonna get this bow. Yo! Now we can shoot freaking arrows. Once we have arrows. We have one... No, we have no arrows. But I see one in the distance. Damn, yeah! Give me that snake. Uh, I mean skin. Got that skin. Alright. Snake, snake. Snake, snake. Oh, this is even more than... This is already was five lying around. Now we can make boots. And now our feet look green from the snake skin. And we have these. With these we can make... Whoops, no, no, I did... Ah, frick, I, I just clicked the sleep icon. Yes, too hot. Get, get up. Phew, all right. No, no, no. I, ah, I, I heard that hiss. And uh, that was a warning. Okay. Let's relax and go into the shadow and drink some. Okay, let's check our inventory. We got snake, snake. I want antidote. For this, I actually just need this grass over here. That's easy enough, thankfully. Oh, right. Let's drop some stuff. No. Wow. Okay, we don't need that much at all. There we go. And the interesting, one of the many interesting things about this game is the minimalism. If we create the antidote, it just goes into the water. And we don't need to have another item in our inventory. That's really fantastic. It has a similar concept with health and uh, there's a speed, uh, speed power up kind of thing that you can create. You have to have a lever for heal. Lever is one of the best things you can have. So don't really want to waste it on health. So I'm going to try to stay healthy. I don't know if we need any more of these. Yeah, these are useful for sh sheaths, which allow us to carry more big items. But next we need a quiver for arrows. And this we get with one more uh, one more snake skin and one rope. Oh, and I see a hat. Fantastic. I really need it. I'm burning up. Okay, snake, you're done for. Give me that hat first. Excellent. And here we have uh, the last snake skin we need to make a quiver. So now we have some uh, arrow container over here. We probably could have found one as well, but this is fine. Oop, and our snake. We don't really need snake skin anymore, but let's let's hunt it down. There is no targeting help, so this is quite quite a challenge to aim. But you know, you get uh, you get the hang out of it. Now here's a unique location. You probably noticed that it looks kind of randomly generated. I'm not sure if it is. Sure looks like it is randomly generated, the, the game. Uh, but here's a pyramid, which is unique. And I guess somebody died over here. Oh yeah, and here's a quiver. We could have totally taken this instead of building one. And I just picked something up. I don't know what it is. Oh, it's a backpack. Oh, that's fantastic. We have double the carrying space now. Oh, excellent. Now we don't have to make one. Because to make one, we need leather. And leather we get from these guys. Oh, and I'm uh, drying up. 
So what I need now are more arrows, 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 so the hunt can begin. Oh, freaking ouch. Okay, good. So we, I think it bit us, but, but I guess we had some time to react. I don't know. Okay, so now we uh, filled up our quiver, but we can still pick up arrows and put them in our backpack, which is pretty great. Oh, and I see some, I see some uh, feathers, and here's a feather. Oh, this is good, good times. Let's take this grass. I don't know what for. Maybe we'll figure out a purpose. Making quick progress, and we did skip creating a hat. We did skip creating the backpack. We could make hasty. Yeah, I need to show up. I need to show off hasty. Let's make an arrow from the rest. And uh, let's get some, let's get some leather. Okay, so we have hasty now, and that is just mixed into the into the water, into the antidote as well. And there's a deer we might want to hunt down in a second. Let's just fill this up with some more, so we don't dry up later. And let's drink it. And now I have a green health bar, and that means I guess that I'm running faster. Okay, let's check how fast we are. We certainly are faster, yeah. Run, run, run. Gotta get that deer. Now we're gonna make uh, an unusual approach. This is not how you're supposed to hunt deer. You're supposed to be a bit stealthy about it. But that's how we're gonna do it. Oh yeah, run into that. Oh, darn, I thought it would run into this rock. Okay, we can kind of shoo it into a certain direction. And shot its butt. And another one. I'm just gonna pick up this. Ah. Yes. Three shots and it's down. We got a bunch of arrows and we're gonna take its skin. Nice. Okay, so what can we create now? We can make heal, we can make sheath. We can. We need much more for armor. Let's make sheath. As you can see, we have one more place to put stuff. Not really useful, to be honest. There's not much we can do. I'm just gonna take this again. And we can take rocks, but you might have seen how inefficient rocks are. Also, there's a big skeleton in the back. Let's check that out. While we just clear the path from more snakes. Oh, there's a lot of arrows around that skeleton. Oh, there's a lot of... There's a lot. Now let's see, what do we need? Uh, we need a poison for heal. We don't need sheath. We're not gonna invest into armor. Okay, he, sh he saw, saw us. He has perfect aim. He also knows how to, uh, you know, calculate where we are going. So he would actually, or it would actually shoot where we are going instead of where we are. Oh, so we have to make a little bit of movement to avoid getting shot. Doesn't have infinite... A reach, thankfully. Oops. Give me that poison. There we go. Alright. Here we are. Mm. We're not gonna use the mix. We're just gonna use it if we need it later. Oh, still need one of these. There we go. Let's double check we have any okay we have all we need for this we don't need snake skin uh, we're gonna keep it we're gonna keep it for later all right let's let's not attack the, the skeleton because it's it's daytime let's sleep instead because at night uh, there's much less problems of heat and we don't want problems with heat because the battle is gonna last forever time to wake up buddy wake up Hello, let's just... Whoops. Oh, great. No, oh, he saw me. Now, here's the annoying part about this game. Um, whoops. Ah, darn it. The annoying part is that... Uh, Aim depends on whether you walk left, walk, walk right. There is some kind of... I mean, if you walk forward, you can kind of estimate... Frick. You can kind of estimate where you're, where you're gonna shoot. Okay, that was the first hit. 
we lost so many arrows. Darn it. Nice. One went into the head, which is useless. Yes. I want to get that arrow. That up there. Okay, great. Uh, yes, Kelly, yes. Nice. Now it took me forever to figure... I mean, I didn't figure out on my own that you can actually damage the thing. There is visual representation of the damage. The red or wine red content of a sphere, uh, sphere is getting smaller as you hit it. But I didn't notice that. I only heard the sound, ding, which to me is a sound of you did not make any damage. I mean, you tried to, but nope, it's glass. You didn't do any damage. Did I just hit a snake? <laughs> it kind of sounded like I hit a snake in the distance. Okay, I got only three arrows and then I gotta start hunting for arrows. Oh, frick. But I wanted to show you something. Because of the title of this video. Look at that. Look how he reacts if I try to get to his feet. He is scared. He is not liking that at all. He reacts to me like I react to snakes. I find that fantastic. Because it's such a... Such a symmetry. The way he reacts to me is the way I react to snakes. Also, I totally made him leave the, his, this pillar. I didn't realize you could make him go that far. I'm just gonna collect some more arrows so I don't have to stress about being all too w good at aiming. I got 7 out of 10. Man, that guy is good at aiming. I just hope the arrows in his um, in his sphere don't despawn. But I don't think they do. Okay. Okay, I'm above 10 now. Now I just need to get close to him without taking damage. Because one hit of his is painful. I think it takes away half of the health. Actually, we can show it off. Really? You know what, buddy? You can take one shot. Ouch. Okay, so that's the health bar that you haven't seen. Oh no, we have seen that when I got bit. So now let's create some heal. And it just get added, gets added to our drink. Uh... Oh no. That's one weird mechanic. You have to be thirsty to be able to drink. So you can't even heal yourself unless you're a little bit thirsty at least. So I had to run a little. Nobody, you're not gonna shoot at me. That's right, that's right. You're gonna run away from me. Yep, yep. This is... This makes it actually easier. Nice! Okay, I got him, I got him. Don't you shoot at me. No! <laughs> you tried, you tried, but nope. Alright, I got him down. Feels good. Finishing this so quickly. We can get rid of one of the stones. Uh, rocks. And now we have the sphere, the orb. Take. Clink. Uh, it has a stick icon. I don't know why, but that's how it is. In the top right, it's a stick. We can throw it. I don't know if we can use it as a weapon. We should try. Hmm. Come, bird. I'm gonna, only gonna try once, because I am not good at this. Oh yeah, uh, that, that was a hit, so I think we... I think that was a hit. So now let's try to find the pyramid. Remember the pyramid? I remember the pyramid. I'm really curious about how this uh, game works regarding placement of objects. How this infinite scrolling map works. Because you always find your way, somehow, to either the skeleton or the pyramids, somehow. Let's give it another try, since it's on our way anyways. Yeah, that was not, not close enough. Alright, uh, let's, uh, let's place the orb here. What the heck? That was a bug, I'm sure. What? Why is my top right stuff gone? Okay, there we go. What? I, I think I broke it. <laughs> I think the game is broken now. The orb is supposed to be floating here. Where the heck did it go? <laughs> 
Oh no. There, I hear it. Yep, it's here, for, for whatever reason. Okay, let's just pick it up and get back to the pyramid. There we go. Maybe it uh, went away because I abused it so much, threw it away all the time, dropped it all the time. Let's be careful and not hit any extra buttons this time. E place. Oh, come on. Oh, well, anyways, I played the game before and here's the recording of that time where I also finished the game. You place the orb in there, it uh, stays there and goes up and turns red and then you can shoot it. And then it just consumes you. Very cool, very nice ending somehow. I mean, much better than just nothing and here press quit to quit. Nope, the game starts again. I actually thought you turn into the next skeleton, which maybe is what happens. And the, here is Sock Pop, their intro you usually don't see because uh, the recorder doesn't quite catch it. Anyways, then you can start the game again. Ah, if you hit a bird with an arrow, you actually get more feathers this way. One, two, three, I think, in this case. And another bird hits the dust. Now one really cool thing you can pull off is a headshot. That one is an instant kill. Nice, and another headshot right here. Six leather mix, one armor plus one leather, and that's how we look like now. And the difference is that we just take less damage from the skeleton, which however is dead and doesn't seem to be wanting to revive. Maybe I just have to restart the game. Now oh, let's see if we can use the orb to Throw a snake to death. Doesn't seem to be the case. Come on, snake, I got an orb for you. Nope, immune. Yeah, rocks work. Pfft. And that was Deer Hunter 2. A very nice experience. You can support the team on Patreon and then you'll get access to all their games or get their games individually on itch. Please subscribe if you haven't yet and I will see you next time. Until then, ciao! Sock pop. 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 Sock pop.